I don't think I got a chance to go over the chemist. The chemist I'm not a big fan of. Pretty much you can use the drinks with the chemist. You can also mix, but not yet. Not yet. We do have a new enemy here. Oh, no. We've seen the Reflect Mage. Just the first time we've seen him here. Mix is probably the real reason that most people go for the chemist. Uh, first to just get the uh, job level up, the first one, uh, which does show off the other ability that I forgot to mention before, uh, which is medicine. Um, basically, healing items, potions, and ethers are... Uh, their effectiveness is doubled when you use it in battle. I believe it's only in battle that you have to... Uh, that that carries over, unfortunately. And Raina's getting very close to her level up. I might change her once we get up there uh, because the answer is not working out so well right now. There we go. Did get that level up for Raina, so I changed her back to a thief uh, with the counter ability moved forward. As a result of leveling up uh, Lancer to level 1, you learn uh, Jump. And as you can see here, it is two times stronger with a spear attack. Um, so if you've got a spear, then Lancer is probably good for you. I don't have one. Like I said, I'm not a big fan of the Lancer. Well, I'll try to show it off a little bit later, though. I'll try to show it off a little bit later. And now we run super fast because we have the Thief back in our party. And we can see the Secret Passage, which saves us a little bit of time. Uh, there's another Secret Passage there. I want to ignore it. I do believe there's more enemies like on this floor is when they start coming up again. Now let's head through here. Do we have one new enemy in this fight? I do not know yet. There it is. There we go. Black Warlock. They have poison rods on them. It's always good to steal from those guys. Will Bart's ever show off that ability that I am hoping that he does? Um, I think Raina needs to be healed a little bit here. Outside of that, I don't think anybody needs to be healed. Okay, that didn't work. Whatever it was, it went by so fast I didn't even see what the what the attack was. But whatever it was, it didn't work. And the Reflect Mage, he's gonna... Really? Oh, you dick. How dare you? Krill was supposed to be my multiple hitting damage dealer here. That is not cool. That is not cool in the slightest. Is that one dead yet? Sit. Smack Krill upside the head. Oh, you bitch. You're not supposed to use white magic on them. Get back on my side. Ice 2. Now he's actually trying to deal some damage. That, that is respectable. Stop! You dick. That was my healer. Die! Oh, that's right. You turns to blink on a... Luckily, I can aim! Blink overrides aim. These warlocks are ruining my day right now. How dare you? How dare you? Ice. 60. Why didn't Bolt do nothing? Wind Slash! There we go. Hit them all for a lot of damage. One of them finally goes down. The one that was being a dick. Alright, this guy can be hit now. Uh, poison Rods are pretty good. They up your poison... Uh, holy crap. They up your poison uh, damage when you use it, but to be honest, poison is so variable. It has such a high random rate between like double digits. You know, you can do like 30 damage with it. And you can do... Um, 300. It's, it just doesn't seem worth it to me. The whole element seems a little off. I, I've never been a fan of the randomness. And if you notice, Ferris does not heal nearly as much as Krill did with the healing rod. That's, it's just too bad. Probably the chemist that does that. Yes, you get 1,119 gills, 700 experience, and 4 ability points. And Krill's gained a job level. You can move Earth forward from this point forward. I swear. That That is... That is crazy, because that is all that I'm doing in these fights is, you know, earth, 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 and I'm just wiping things out. Uh, because I have the Geomancer in my party, I can go into the lava! And there is a good reason to go into the lava. Why that works with a Geomancer is because of science. Geomancy science. And also new enemy science. We are up against Hypnot, uh, uh, along with the Black Warlock. Will Bart's ever show off the ability that I am looking for? Probably not, but I'm going to keep hoping. Critical, not enough for the victory, unfortunately. Let's go for another Earth. You need to smack him upside the head. Wind Slash is going to is probably one of the best things that I can get in this area. Um, I should mention, though, there is a, a key difference between Final Fantasy III's uh, Geomancer. I'm not even sure if it's... 
what they called it. Was it called Earth the actual ability in, in Final Fantasy III? I'm, I'm a little confused about that now. Uh, but uh, the ability in Final Fantasy III, it could cast anything up to and including Flare. Uh, in this one, it's much more limited than that. There's usually a list of about four or five you can use in each dungeon, and as you go from dungeon to dungeon, it changes. Uh, so it's a little different there, but still a very nice ability to have. Uh, it can do a lot of damage to everybody, as you saw, and it's free! It doesn't cost you anything. Critical hit, down goes the Hypnot, we're just down to the Black Warlock. Now, if I could use... Oh, you... Mm. Sonic Boom is what was trying to be used there. Didn't work, though. Phoenix down... Freaking Doom? You kidding me? <sighs> Doom guy ruins me yet again. Damn him. Alright, go for aim. Try to kill the Black Warlock. One more good hit should be enough here. Break, are you kidding me? <sighs> now I gotta use soft. This guy is a douche. I hate the Black Warlocks. You know, he kind of looks like... This might just be me talking, right? No, knowing Final Fantasy later on. If you haven't played later Final Fantasies, you might not know what I'm talking about, but he looks like a prototype for the Tonberry, doesn't he? With the knife out like that, and like his face hidden, and the, th and the light that he's holding. He looks, he looks like a prototype. Whatever. You get 1,137 gil for that fight, 812 experience, and 7 ability points. That is ridiculous. 7 ability points for fighting those 3 enemies. And they weren't that difficult. Uh, he was douchey about it, but hey, I got a phoenix down back from that. And we're still in lava, but uh, should you not have a Geomancer in your party, uh, you will take damage from the lava, you know, like one at a time or whatever. But if you keep the Geomancer in, you're free to get the Gale Bow. Very nice. I want to equip that right away, as you saw from uh, 56, which was the highest that I had, up to 69 is a huge improvement. You don't even need to get the elf bow, to be honest with you. Probably could have held back on that. But uh, we can now take a shortcut through the lava. <laughs> shortcut through the lava. It saves you time. For when you take on yet more enemies. I thought we were done with new enemies here, but we're up against Adam and Golem. Uh, I assume that's supposed to be adamanti adamantium or adamantite golems, but it just says adamant golems. There we go! Here is the ability that I was looking for! This is S-Shot. Uh, what it does is it uses uh, your shot. It, it fires four attacks. Very nice ability. That is what we are aiming for uh, to bring forward from the hunter class. Uh, unfortunately, when you are a hunter, you can only use it at, when you have a bow equipped. It does take, I believe, about half um, half your damage away, but you get four attacks, so it's only about uh, twice as much damage overall. But uh, it's a very nice ability to have, and it only seems to work with some bows. It doesn't even work with all of them, as far as I can tell. Wind slash, so good, so good. I need to hit everybody here. Can can we just line them all up and smack them across the face? Will that work? It never seems to work that way. Continue to fight them. They must die. Damn. They, they hit pretty hard, too. They do. Actually, if that's all they do on my thief, it's not that much. But counter does help me in the l well, short term, I guess you could say. Earth! Sonic Boom! Damn it. Did Guile teach you how to do that? Because that didn't look right. That did not look like a Sonic Boom to me. He probably didn't do it right, right which is why he didn't die, Krill. Reyna had to finish him off with a slash. Slashing golems. It works every time. Yes, you get 756 gil, 550 experience, and 4 ability points. Yeah, adamantium, adamantite. I get confused, especially... It's probably different between versions of this game. Alright, shortcut through the lava accomplished. Now we can just head down. I swear we're out of new enemies here. I see that treasure chest there. I want to get it. We are out of new enemies here. Finally, there's an elixir in there. I'll take it. I'll take any elixir, really. And as a result of that battle, Ferris did learn the mixability from Chemist. Get the job level up there. Uh, basically, what that does is you, you take two ingredients, you mix them together, and it makes, well, more or less a random 
uh, potion. I mean, it's the same one every time, but it's very hard to predict, so usually you have to list in front of you. We have a puzzle room in front of us! What we need to do is press the X button at the right time here. There we go! Perfect timing! Can head up here and get the Blizzard Sword, is actually what that is. Do I have anybody that can use a sword? No. So, we can't really see it, but it's an Ice Elemental Sword, which can be very useful. Let's go ahead and step on that again, and try to stop it right... Mmm, didn't time that right. So, uh, I get into a fight. Once you, when you get in front of the pillars, you get into a fight with... Uh, it's kind of random, but we are up against an abductor. We have seen him uh, before, uh, but it has been a lot while, and he's pretty damn hard. Uh, and it's kind of a punishment for me, so I might as well keep it in. It's a punishment for you, I swear it is. Sonic Boo! Good lord. <laughs> did you see how much damage that did? Sonic Boom! See, guy, I'll taught you how to do that one. You took my advice, Krill. I like that about you. Uh, looks like you tried to do a hurricane there, but it missed. That works very similar to tornadoes in the previous games. Uh, it puts you into a... Oh, there we go! S shot again, even if there's just the one enemy. I believe that's like spread shot or speed shot in, um... Game Boy Advance version. Uh, you know, with Hurricane, it puts you into single digit HP, uh, but it, it misses so much. You get 125 experience, two ability points for that fight. Uh, not that difficult, but damn, does he have a lot of HP. Uh, luckily, Krill was there to whittle that down, and we need to try this again. Let's step on this, get our timing right yet again. There we go. And we can get a Kotetsu out of there. Very nice uh, Japanese style blade. We're also up against new enemies. Uh, motor drives. I forgot that these guys were here. Holy crap, they can counter. And they counter hard. Holy crap. I'm, I need to heal Ferris immediately. Or heal Reyna immediately. Reyna is not looking good right now. Go Gust. So we're not going to be hitting them with with uh, Reyna anymore. I keep on wanting to call her Ferris today for whatever reason. We're going to steal with her though. That's for sure. What do you got on you? He's got a tonic. Great. Uh, for some reason though, we can hit him with this. And he didn't counter that. No, nope, he counters it. No, that was just his regular turn. Interesting. Alright, let's keep on going for that. Sonic Boom for the win? Not for the win just yet. We still need to heal Reyna. Reyna is not doing so great. Ferris is not that great of a healer. Potions are pretty much what you're supposed to use the chemist for, not for what I'm using it for. Right, let's go ahead and try to steal from the back one. We did, which means that uh, there's nothing more for Reyna to do. So I'm kind of hoping that Krill will finish him off with a good attack here. Down goes one of them. Can I get the sonic boom on the other guy or something even stronger? Do you have something stronger? Ah, Gust. Gust is not that great. Alright, finally looks like uh, Reyna, Reyna's HP has stopped going down. Uh, we're probably still not going to counter. Uh, you only can steal once, right? Yeah, you can only steal once in this game. There are other games where uh, enemies will have two or three items on them, but not this game, not this one. Come on, Sonic Boom! Wind Slash! Well, that's decent, I guess. And then let's try to heal whoever has the least amount of HP right now. Right now, that's Ferris. I believe Ferris actually now has over a thousand HP. Uh, don't think that got a chance to show it off, though. Uh, defend. Why not? Because we don't want you getting hit again. That was bad. Aim. S shot. That will do. As you can see, though, it does uh, half per hit. So it's still only about double the attack, but. It is still a very nice ability to have. Down it finally goes. You get a 768 gil, 650 experience, and 4 ability points. Reyna uh, caught up to everybody else. We are now uh, level 30 across the board. Everybody got that, uh, a level up in the last fight except for her, unfortunately. Alright, so we need to step on the skull again, and just anywhere in the middle, really. If I step here, yeah, that doesn't do anything. But we can head up here, and we have reached a save point, and that is going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Final Fantasy V. I've been Bala Scuba, I've been joined, as always, by my I can't believe I beat the freaking turtle squad of Bart's Reina, Krill, and Ferris. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching. <laughs>